Hi, it's Jiu Jitsu Professor. I'm going to show you uh, some uh, techniques today. We're going to do uh, escaping the, the guillotine, just a basic one. And then I'm going to do another one showing with the, uh, the, arm and, uh, the head and arm inside the guillotine. So I'm here in the guy's guard, sits up, grabs the guillotine here, and hands in tight. Now, first thing I have to remember is I have to turn my chin in and put my jawbone on his wrist. At the same time, I'm going to grab his wrist with this hand here. What I'm going to do is take this hand here, cuff it, when he sits back, cuff it on top of his leg here. Just like that. He's going to lock his legs, and he's going to try and push his hips up. I just keep a good base here, keeping the pressure on his neck. I'm going to start following my shoulder. Start walking towards my shoulder. Here, here, until I get my head out. I don't worry so much about passing the guard or getting out, even though sometimes I may have the option to. But the most important thing is getting my neck out first, okay? Before, because sometimes, even if I pass, he can have me in the half guard and still finish me with the guillotine. Or even on the side mount, sometimes people have been finished that way. <clears throat> Again, guys here. <clears throat> Men tight, trying to pass, he sits up, grabs around my neck, and a lot of guys are fast and doing this technique. So as soon as he grabs the neck, turn the chin in, grab his wrist. Then, when he starts to sit back, put your arm underneath his neck. Just like that. Walk up, put the pressure, but follow your shoulder. Follow your shoulder that's under his neck until you get your head out. And as soon as you get your head out, posture up. One more time. Heads around. Grab the wrist, chin in, start to put the arm up, boom. Start to follow, follow your shoulder, boom. So they get out, boom. Get back in the guard, posture up. The guillotine is the ultimate equalizer. I've seen so many good guys lose to this position because you learned this position in the very beginning, but yet not everybody practices and escapes all the time. Practice escape um, at least 10 times each side and make sure you uh, get your students to do a uh, warm-up drill with it, uh, two rounds of two minutes, all right?